What's going on everybody? It's your boy So Stylistic and I am back with another video. Before we get into this video, I need y'all to do me a big big favor. I need y'all to thumbs this video up. I have been hearing so many content creators asking people to thumb things up because of the algorithm. And so I really need y'all to do me that big favor because it is very, very true. Um, I thought it was all about the subscribers, but I'm learning now that it's really about the interaction, the thumbs ups, the comments. So please make sure that you thumbs up, like this video, subscribe, make sure you subscribe. And comment in the comment section below. I try to get back to you all all the time because I love to do it and I and you don't have to. So I make sure that I do. <laughs> all right, guys, let's get into this video. All right, you guys, so I am back with my lovely client that has been rocking with me for some years now. And she is a every week client and she's been rocking with me for some years and I love her for it. Um, before the year came in, we had this bet that we was going to let our top grow out. And I don't know if I did a video of it, but we did let her top grow out. But as soon as January 1st hit, she was like, I'm ready to cut it again. <laughs> this is her signature style. She loves it. I love it on her. I think I've gotten so used to it that like when we do other things, they look good, but it's just not her. So this is her style and I love it. I feel like this is one of those uh, classic styles that really never um, go out of style when it comes to short hair um you know the flips and things like that that little um, pompadour in the front like i just feel like it's just a classic style um and it looks good you know um yeah it looks good but um we did go and put some color in the color is a little old right now but we did put some color in just to make it pop um, she's starting to gray, so we wanted to just put something in there that was going to mesh in with the gray, which I absolutely love her gray, um, but we did want to give her some flair and some pop, so um, we did do that. The color is a little bit old, but as you can tell, old color does not always look bad. You know, um, that's where we get the ombre and stuff from, um, color that does look like it's been there for a while when we go and we do a shadow root and all that kind of stuff, but um actually sometimes whenever you go in and do a fresh cut it makes the color look like you've just done it so um in case you're wondering that color we did that a while back like in 2022 um probably like the summertime but it is popping on this hairstyle i have to say but yeah um so my tools that i'm using because i know you guys ask sometimes what tools i'm using i'm using my eap iron right now so i go between my micro um h2 pro iron and my eap iron and you also see me use one of my other the red plate is also h2 pro um but those are my go-to irons between eap and um, h2 pro that's pretty much what i use in the salon um they work um i absolutely love them i have had any problems with them and they last too i think i just opened this one up um i think it's fairly new i had it from a show which was back in like 2020 so that lets you know how long my other one lasted and it was still going um i just wanted to use a fresh iron and i think i blessed somebody with the other one um but yeah they they last and i use my irons on the regular so y'all know style is how we are we use them on the regular so if you take care of your cords you know clean them on a the regular they will last um so yeah those are my go-to irons again i want to thank you all so much for rocking with me for those of you that's been seeing my um uh, shorts i've been trying to learn the whole algorithm thing with the shorts like what's the best time to put them up and all that good stuff but um those of you that's been commenting and liking the shorts and things of that nature thank you so much make sure y'all thumbs up that's a big thing like i say this all the time and i say it to people because i have done it before in the past but i realized that if this is someone's um side income which we all need right now <laughs> Um, I make sure that I thumbs the video up because I realize that it puts it in a certain algorithm. You know, people get to see it more when you start interacting with the video. So you guys do me that favor. Um, I'm never on here asking for tips or anything like that. That just really helps us get the videos out there as content creators. So if you're 
other content creator don't don't ride past the video and don't like it all right because <laughs> i make sure i like y'all but if you're not and you just subscribe to the channel make sure you hit that thumbs up button and interact in the comment section below i'd love to hear your thoughts um and i just really thank you guys so much again for rocking with me happy 2023 um i know we are walking into february already um, so the year is starting to fly by already but um you guys keep me in prayer and keep me lifted and send good vibes and love this way because i definitely need it and i will talk to you guys soon love you much peace